Dr. Shafali is a clinical psychologist and an award-winning author. She is the author of three books, including The Conscious Parent, acclaimed by Oprah Winfrey as one of the most profound books she has ever read on parenting. For the next three days, people from around the globe will gather in Long Beach, California to hear Dr. Shafari speak at her latest conference, Evolve the Conscious Way. Participants say they come to Dr. Shafari's events for inspiration, awakening of the mind and spirit, for personal empowerment and transformation. Can you tell me your name, please? My name is Kelly Hutchison. I'm from Wellington, Florida. I'm from Charlotte, North Carolina. They're from Monterrey, Mexico. I live in Cincinnati, but I am from Brazil. Dr. Shafali is a inspirational, wise soul. Um, she connects with people on a very spiritual level, and she's so honest about it. And that was like my church every Sunday. Uh, we watched Super Soul Sunday with my little baby, and I watched Dr. Shafali's episode, and I started crying. People at school noticed that her moms would say, Lily's just changed. She's growing up. She's maturing. I'm like, it has nothing to do with growing up and maturing. It is all that I have changed because of this book. So it is life-changing, truly. Talk to me about this event and how it got started. Well, the vision was to bring together a collective consciousness where we could expand the message of conscious parenting and really teach that parenting is about the raising of the parent's self. We named this event Evolve the Conscious Way and we hope parents and non-parents alike come toward this message so that we can transform the next generation. And the concept it was so different from anything that I had read or heard on parenting. It's so aligned with what I was wanting to do or when my heart was feeling pulled. You talk a lot about meditation and how meditation can help parenting. Can you kind of elaborate on that? So I think one of the most powerful tools to be a parent is to be able to enter the now space because children live in the now, right? Children are in the present moment. And one of the dysfunctions of parenthood is that we cannot enter the now with them. We are in the yesterday and we are in the fear of the tomorrow. One of the tools to help you enter the now is mindfulness, is meditation. Meditation is not religious, it's not even spiritual, it's just a technique. It allows you to step back from a reactive space and learn to just be a witness to the present moment. How do you um, talk to a parent that does not know how to control the child, but then the child controls the parent? So this is not about who has control over the other. This is about how both parent and child can grow together and rise and allow and honor each one's ability to be authors of their own life. I tell parents, you know, this grand fantasy you have for your children's future is but the size of a matchbox compared to their inherent destiny. Something about that world and where the child has as much of a, of a voice as the parent does was so powerful to me. They're coming in large numbers to hear her because they're yearning for insight wisdom, assistance, and help, and they're responding so powerfully to her, because when she finishes speaking, they have the direct experience of, ah, I just heard from someone who totally understands. They come for a variety of reasons, as hopeful future parents, as parents experiencing the complexity of raising confident children in a fast-paced and modern world, as young adults seeking a more meaningful connection with their families. But one thing is for sure, people connect with Dr. Shafali. She is, in the words of Neil Donald Walsh, the gateway to conscious parenting.